So when you're working with pictures inside of InCopy, you can directly take it into another application and then edit it. So to do that, I'm just going to go to file and then I'm going to uh, place out an image right here. So I'm just going to go around and place, let's say for example, this image and press open. So the image size is quite large. So I'm just going to resize this out. So I'm just going to go around and then resize it out just like this. I'm just going to resize out the frame as well. There you go. So now I have an image and let's say that I want to edit out this image. So in order to do that, I can do this. So I can simply select this out, select this image. I can go to edit and here you have option called edit original and edit with. So let us go to edit original first and then the default picture application of your operating system will open out where you can maybe crop out the picture right here and maybe rotate out the picture right here, apply filters and so forth. So I'm just going to apply a bit of a filter as well. And let's say I want to save a copy of this. So I'm just going to go around, not save a copy, but directly replace it out. So I directly replace the picture. So I'm just going to close it. And then over here, you don't see the changes yet. So to refresh out the picture, which I already edited, we can simply go to Windows and then go to Links. And over here, you'll see all the pictures that are there. So you can just refresh this out and the new edited picture is right here. Another thing that you can do is edit it with um, an application of your choice. Let's say, for example, you want to edit it with Photoshop. You can go to edit, then you can go to edit with and over here, there's different applications that you can choose right over here. So I'm just going to choose uh, Adobe Photoshop just like this. And then what happens is that it opens up uh, the same picture in Photoshop and I can edit that out. So I'm just going to wait for this to open and the image has been opened up in Photoshop. So I'm just going to go around and make some adjustments in levels right over here. So I can do a more precise editing right over here. And then I can go around into maybe hue and saturation. I'm going to choose something like blues and change this around. And if you want to learn more about Photoshop, you can look at my tutorial series on Photoshop as well. So I just seems I did a few basic editings and I'm going to save this around. And I'm just going to save that, replace that around right there. So I can simply close Photoshop now and then I can refresh it and you can see that the edited picture is there. And that is how you can edit or, uh, edit original and edit with uh, different applications for photos inside of Adobe in copy. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.